Welcome back to another episode of Base Set Goni. We have the somewhat new setup. Just rearranged this. Got a planer wall because uh, I don't think looking at my bed is always the greatest thing. But uh, today we're going to be doing something a little different. Originally I was going to post a video of uh, me going to different stores. And I had a bunch of footage of it, but I ended up not going... I mean, I went to a lot of stores, but I ended up not finding a single thing. And I'm sure you guys didn't want to watch 20 minutes of me just going, well, nothing here, nothing here. Um, I ended up finding some stuff at Walmart. As you can see, there's a couple Darkness of Blades and Sword and Shields. Um, I bought six tins, which was, um, you know, two of the legendary dogs from Sword and Shield. Um, they're right here. We'll open up those in the next video. And I also got about 20 to 30 of these uh, Sword and Shield and uh, Darkness of Blades. It's like 15. I think it's like 20 Sword and Shield and maybe 10 Darkness of Blades. You can see kind of my dogs peeking out right there. Good old Charles. But uh, we're going to be doing, obviously, what everybody else is doing. The um, McDonald's Happy Meals Toys. What you doing? He looks like getting away. Uh, we're doing the McDonald's Happy Meals today. So we have two different things. We obviously have one right here. They're both open. But um, this one, I just had a family member come by and drop it off because it is uh, snowing outside really bad. And um, so we kind of went and go ahead and did that one. Uh, this box is in a little better shape than this one. Again, I need to clarify because Pokemon community right now is going go through a crazy storm. We are not um, reselling these. We're not going to scalp these. We just have them to have them because, um, you know, we're all Pokemon fans here. Um, I'm not reselling any of these. You know, they're reprinting more anyway, so hopefully that'll kill the scalpers. But uh, nonetheless, this box right here already has two packs of opened up, or I think one or two packs opened. So we're going to just get a look at that. And then here we have, in this one, we have about 20, about 20 unopened uh, sealed. So we're going to do those here in a bit. After... Okay. Like I said, we're going to see what's in this one first because this one's already open. Kind of give us a clue. Um, I don't know what's in here yet. She just said uh, she had dropped a couple of stuff off. She got two of them and she opened them. So we're going to try to put those to the side. And as you can see, Pikachu box is very nice. You got Pikachu up front. Um, you got some weird little game thing on the side. McDonald's logo, McDonald's logo. Um, toys. And this is the box. So we're going to kind of keep this right here. And we're going to go into GoPro mode and see these. So these, like I said, are already opened. They're both number two, which um, I only see one to two. I haven't gotten to three, so I don't know if there's different packs. But we're going to slowly open this. Like I said, these are already open. We just kind of want to see what's in here. So you get a little booklet of stickers, which is kind of cool. Which is really cool, actually. Um, stickers are always the greatest thing. We're going to keep those intact just because, you know, we like to keep stuff intact around here. Um, so it comes with stickers. Comes with kind of like a little, little beach ocean view. You can kind of see what I'm talking about. Um, on the back, it's got another picture. Cool little booklet, I guess, to keep your cards in. Maybe I'm not entirely sure. And then the rest is just a plastic thing with Pikachu on the bottom. You can fold this somehow for a display, but I don't really want to get into all that right now. So we're gonna take this pack out of the second one since we already know what's in here. Like I said, this is my first time seeing these as well. Um, she said she opened them, but I don't know what's in here, so let's, well, one kind of fell. Let's go for this first pack. As you can see, you got the three stars and Pikachu around there. Very traditional, 25th anniversary, going old school. Already opened up. <gasps> Excuse me. So we got a Sobble, Piplup, and these all have the little 25th anniversary logo right there. Oops. Piplup, Opalin, Score Bunny. Ooh, Nice. Told it I was one of my favorite. Um, it's got that, I'm pretty sure this is a McDonald's exclusive because last year, or a couple years ago, they had some other exclusives that weren't as popular because people weren't as scalping them as hard. But um, you can kind of see it's got that, uh, it's got those little weird dots kind of pattern, which I'm pretty sure is exclusive McDonald's, but that's cool. Let's go to the second pack that's already opened up. Off the top, we have the Pikachu. I don't even want to open these now because that's all I really wanted was a Pikachu. I do want a Squirtle though. So there's that Pikachu, 25th anniversary, McDonald's thing on the back. Let's go to the rest, Turtwig, Grookey, and that's it on that one. Um, so that's really cool. We already have Pikachu, we already have Totodile since these were already opened up. But without further ado, let's go ahead, put these to the side, put these in the box that's already open. Without further ado, let's just go ahead and start opening these. We have 20 of these. Um, I think we're going to try to do 10 in this video and uh, do the rest, maybe open up, I think we're going to do 10, open up one or two tins, 
and then do the rest of the next video. Um, some of these are kind of already opened up just because, you know, I have so many stuff in one box. But here's that sealed thing with the little puzzle in the back. Ooh, this one has a different toy in it. Okay, so this is the number one. The number two, you still have that little map. Um, this is to display your cards, I assume, but I'm not going to assemble it just because I'm not that good at cardboard mache. Is that is that what it's called? Cardboard mache? But it's got a little card holder for your cards. Um, this one doesn't have stickers. It's got another little card holder, which I like the one that has stickers more, honestly. Um, it's cool to see the Pokemon logo everywhere. It's cool, 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 but I like the stickers. And this one has a maze on the bottom. So that's what comes in the number one pack. The other ones were number two. Um, here's the number two. We're going to open that up separately. All right. Here's to the first sealed 25th anniversary McDonald's. Let's go ahead and open her up. I want to keep these almost as intact as possible. Um, these are sealed really easily. So the good thing is you could just kind of come in from the back, pop them open. Okay, so they are face down. So try not to see them. Try not to bend them. We're just going to try to open them as clean as possible because I really do like the arc on these packs. Um, feels very nostalgic. You know, you got the three starters, started it all. You got Pikachu. So I kind of want to keep these, the cardboard on these isn't the greatest, it's not that styrofoam thing we're all used to, but open that to the side, which I don't know what order they're in, they give you four per pack, um, I'm not sure which one's the rare, oh, I guess the rare is very up front, alright, we got a Froki, nice, I wasn't aware of which order they were in, but cool, we already have a Froki, that's really cool, um, classic dots, classic dots, McDonald's dots, cool, keep him right here, with the nice little trio that we have, then we got a Grookey, Sobble and a score bunny. Cool. So we're gonna start stacking these in a little pile up here. Um, these are the open ones. We'll keep these up here. These are our open packs. Um, these little cardboard things, we'll keep these two because I feel like I really like these. Keep those up there. So this is number two. The pretty sure the number two comes with stickers. There's the black background, there's a the white background, and then there's a blue, like a sky blue kind of background. Um, there's a sealed one, number two. Oh, they all come with different things, I guess. Well, no, no, some of the, okay, number two's come with puzzles. They all, I'm pretty sure, have a different mini game in the back, a little cardboard mini game. But uh, two come with stickers, um, and then the one, of course, comes with, these are all the 25 hauls that you can get, which we only have 20, so I don't think we're going to get every single one, but we got the ones we wanted. We just need a Squirtle now, and I'll be happy. Um, there's those. So, yeah, this one has a different puzzle in the back. Close that up. That's number two. Wait, I guess I gotta put the little pamp back in there, huh? Close that up. And here you go. This corner's been on this one. Just fine. Second pack, McDonald's 25th anniversary. Um, if you haven't been able to get your hands on these, don't be surprised. Like I said, the uh, Pokemon community right now is going crazy. It's going, it's just a blitz out there. Um, like I said, I went to 30 different stores just to try to find the six tins and maybe 25 booster packs. Uh, they are reprinting, if you guys haven't known that by now. They are reprinting more, which is going to keep scalpers away because, you know, people are reselling sealed stuff like this, tins, McDonald's toys. So that's going to help out in uh, keeping those scalpers down. And that's also going to help everybody get more cards, which is awesome because that's really what we want. Um, you know, these cards right now aren't worth the crazy most expensive, but they all will. Pokemon cards, every single Pokemon card takes a couple years and then starts getting valuable just because of the age. So if you have any Pokemon cards now, keep them in binders, keep them in, uh, um, man, this cardboard stuff is really hard to open. Keep them in binders. My dog's eating his foot right now. What you doing? Um, keep them in binders, you know, keep them good because every single Pokemon card will go up eventually. Not all single commons, but I'm talking about hollows, reverse hollows, and uh, it's kind of hard not to see the hollow in these, which sucks, but... Because I'm trying to preserve the pack, but nice. As you can see there, we got a Chimchar, so we're doing good. We haven't hit any uh, duplicates so far, which is really, really good. The Chimchar, I like the artwork on that. He's holding on. I'm pretty sure these might be reprints. Like, the actual style of the card, the artwork is a reprint just with all of I'm not too sure about that. Um, nice, you got the Chimchar. Fire Monkey. So, and then you got a Piplup, Finnegan, and a Torchic. Okay, so we got a nice little pile on here. We're four for 25, so we have 21 left. Um, and so like I said, unfortunately, we don't have 21 of these. Uh, we'll go with a light blue one, so I can tell you there's kind of light blue. There's a black one, and under that one, there's a white one. Um, we're getting pretty good luck. We have not had a duplicate, which I'm happy about. And these are barely held on by a little glue, so if it looks like these are are, are, or are open, it's because they kind of are. It's really hard to keep the little, because, I mean, you can kind of see. It's like a little tiny little dot of glue. 
tiny little dotted glue. Um, but we're not going to really be showing these just because they're all the same. We're just start taking the packs out. This one's a light blue one, different toy. And that one's a number two, so that one comes with stickers. Um, I wonder if there's a better way to open these. No. Well, this, this way's a little faster. Nice. We can kind of see a little turtwig peeking out there, which is cool. No duplicates, but I'm loving it. Look at turtwig. One of my favorite grass starters. Very nice, very nice. Turtwig chilling in the background with his hollow. Cool, so we haven't hit any duplicates. We're still doing good. Got a Froakie, Sobble, and a Litten. Nice. Uh, we've opened up three. Uh, like I said, we're going to do ten in this one, and then we're going to do um, maybe a tin or two. Um, there's number two with the black background. We'll open that up. You can kind of hear the click. Take the pack out, and we'll put these back here. So we're on to pack number four. This is our fourth pack. Um, I'm really liking these. Like I said, if you can't get any right now, don't worry. Um, you'll get yours eventually if you just keep trying to hard enough. Um, scalpers are crazy, but I'm really liking these. These are really cool. This is really awesome that McDonald's has done, been doing this with Pokemon for a while now. Um, before they used to give out toys. Like I said, they did another anniversary one. Or not anniversary, but they did another collab with McDonald's. Um, as you can see here, we got a Rolette, which is awesome. The Hollow. This one kind of has squares. I don't know if you can tell. This one kind of has like a square hollow pattern. Kind of hard to tell. But uh, that one's cool. No duplicates there. Bulbasaur, I want that. Turtle, Squirtle. Squirtle's the one I want the most in Hollow. I It's cool that we have a Pikachu already, but I do want this Squirtle. And a Score Bunny. Alrighty, on to pack number five. We're going to go ahead and switch it up and get the... Uh, oh, already switched it up. Get this black one. Pop that open. Take the pack out. In the back right there, you see Squirtle, or Pikachu, Totodile, Froakie, Chimchar, Turtwig, and Rolette. And uh, the rule with these, if you're going <clears throat> through McDonald's drive-thru and you do find one that has one, you can only order five individual packets. Um, you could order five, I guess, Happy Meals, entire Happy Meals if you want. The entire Happy Meal is about five bucks. The cards are around three dollars, maybe four dollars after tax. Um, you can order up to five. Nice. Bulbasaur. Nice. We were just talking about him, too. Sweet. Um, you can order up to five of these packs individual or the five in, um, uh, what do you call it? Look at that little squirtle. Charmander up here is kind of cool looking. He's really cool looking. We want that one. Send a quill and a score bunny. We have like 30 score bunnies. But yeah, you can order up to five of these. I don't know. I keep saying that. I can't finish my sentence. Or, and uh, you can only order five per person, but you can go around in the drive through at the same store and keep ordering and ordering. Um, again, not for scalpers, but if you really want to open them like I'm doing them, you can go around in the same drive through or if there's another McDonald's nearby, you know, you can go to that one and go back. Um, there are ways around it to get more than one. But, uh, oh, I think we got our first, we got our first uh, duplicate. But that's how you do the McDonald's. I think it's 16 cents, $16 and some change for, uh, I have the receipt around here somewhere for five, which isn't bad. Because you get a guaranteed hollow in all of these. We have a duplicate, two Froakies. First duplicate, we'll set them off to the side. Uh, you got the Pikachu and the Mudkip. So, yeah, we are at how many? One, two, three, four, five. We'll open up a couple more. Just because, you know, these are cool. But, uh, you know, they're guaranteed pulls and it's cool seeing them, but we're not going to open up all these. We're gonna do, yes, so glad we got that. I kind of see I'm already peeking out. We got the Charmander, we are talking about them and we keep getting exactly what we're talking about, so. There's that Charmander. Nice. So we have, so far, there's Gookie, Topig, and that dude. So we have a Pikachu, Toadal, Bulbasaur, Charmander, um, Chimchar, Froakie, Turtwig and a Rolette. So we're going to do one more. We're just going to grab one more of these. Open her up. Then we're going to do some of these Sword and Shield that I have around just because we have a couple packs. This is the last one of these. We're going to do the rest in the videos, other videos. Don't worry. There's that. Try to preserve the cardboard as much as I can. And this one, hopefully we get a Squirtle. Oh, I see a duplicate. That's all right. Turtwig it is. Not a problem. Cool, cool, cool. There's that Turtwig, Pikachu, Frenikin, and Ch Chimchar. 
All right, we got another duplicate. Let's go open up one more. <laughs> I'm addicted now. I really like these. Um, I just want to get a Bulbasaur really bad. Open that up, put them right there. And like I said, these are going for really high prices. Don't fall for it. I know they're really cool and I know everybody wants one. Don't give the scalpers, um, don't give them the benefit of the doubt. People are reselling these like crazy. Nice, we got a new hollow. Um, don't go for that. Chest pin, I know you probably really want them. Trico, Squirtle, and a Totodile. I want that Squirtle so bad. All right, so let's do a quick little recap. We have the Pikachu, we have the Totodile, Bulbasaur, Charmander, Chespin, Roulette, Turtwig, Chimchar, Froakie, and we also have two duplicates. We have a Turtwig duplicate and a Froakie duplicate. So these are really cool. Um, I do have sleeves. Well, I should have sleeves. Yeah, they're right here. We're going to go ahead and sleeve these up. Put all these in the sleeves. I'll give a quick little recap on that. I'm coming up to the 20 minute mark, so we might not open up a 10, but Roulette, Chespin, Charmander, um, Chimchar, Totodile, Froakie, Turtwig, Bulbasaur, Pikachu, and Froakie. We have two duplicates, but not bad. We're gonna save all these. Those are really cool. We got some good pulls. We got the Pikachu, uh, which we kinda already had. Um, haven't got the Squirtle yet. We got most of the starters. But now without further ado, we're gonna grab one of these tins right here. Um, we got these at Walmart, 20 bucks a tin. We'll go ahead and open up the Zamazenta tins. And these are the ones that come with four of the bigger ones. We'll open up one of these. And uh, like I said, I haven't said that actually, but welcome back to the channel. Well, I kind of said at the beginning. Um, I hope you guys like the content, subscribe, like, comment, um, turn on notifications. You know, the gist, do your own thing. Really support the channel. Hoping you guys are liking it. And I think we've seen these tins before. Maybe we've seen one or two, but just in case we haven't, there's a Zomazint. Um, there's a QR code for one of you guys. And we have a, I'm gonna put this to the side first. I'm gonna keep that out. The tin, we have a Rebel Clash. Oops, Rebel Clash, Rebel Clash, Sword and Shield. Oh, yes! I am so glad we got these. Now we have six of these. We have chances after chances. We're gonna save this to the very end. Guys, if we pull the Charizard, that would make this video. We're going to do the Rebel Clash. I did not know these had the uh, X and Ys on there, honestly. Evolutions. Uh, those have been going for a lot. People have been reselling them pretty, uh, pretty high dollar, but we're not going to do that. Like I said, we're here just to open them up. We're here for the videos. We're here for the polls. We're here for the excitement. We are not here to resell, resell, resell. Even though I guess it's a business to a certain extent, but, you know, it's just not me. One, two, three, one, two. All right, first Rebel Clash of this Zamazenta tin. We have a Stuffle, Coughing, don't know how to say it, Shinx, Sandy Gast, the Reverse Hollow is a Vullaby, Chicken Dude, little chicken guy, okay, we have a Tool Scraper, Cursed Shovel, oh, Mesquirian, oh no, okay, we got a Galarian, the Coughing Dude, not the Coughing, Coughing, C-O-F-F-I-N, for the first one, not too bad. Rebel Clash, Sword and Shield. Actually, what I think I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna save the X and Y evolutions from every pack. <laughs> Some kids are outside my door, or my window. They are uh, they have an ATV going on, and they're pulling the kid behind them in a little bobsled. Oh, to be a kid. And uh, yeah, I might save these X and Y evolutions. There's a QR for a very video of itself, very end of it, just to end it all. This is another Rebel Clash. There's that, Scyther, Nose Pass, Wingle, Coughing, ooh, the Rissol's a Luxio. I like the electric patterns on these. Kind of see it a little bit. Luxio, Metapod, Burning Scarf. Oh no, that's the rare, Galarian, whatever that guy's name. Okay, we're getting a lot of not crazy good pulls. This Sword and Shield I know is gonna come through. We're gonna get a Rainbow Rare in this one right here. Don't you guys worry about that. We can open it. All right. Let's see what we can get out of this one. There is the QR code. One, two, three. One, two. Second to last pack, we have a score bunny. Pikachu. Nice. Sinistee. Wooloo. Shelder. Reverse hollow is Drizzly. Drizzly, maybe? Nice. Haunter. Vitality band. Reboot, come on, please. No, Durant for the rare, really? 
Alrighty, here comes X and Y Evolutions. Very last pack to end the video. Hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on notifications, share, whatever you wish to do. X and Y Evolutions. Can we get the amazing Hollow Charizard? Is the real question. There's that QR code for one of you guys. Maybe you guys can get the Charizard on there. All right, last pack. Let's go. We already had a lot of good hits. Just the McDonald's pack, so I'm not mad. Jarowsey. Caterpie, Doduo, Pikachu, Yellow Cheeks Pikachu. I wonder if they uh, correct the Yellow Cheeks and Red Cheeks on here. Pikachu, Watch Shop, come on. Brock's Grit, nice. Low Bro Spirit Link. Oh, I keep seeing red and I get so excited. Okay, the Reverse Hollow's a Machoke. Not bad. We didn't get any crazy good pulls on there. There's a Reverse Hollow. Um, thanks guys for watching. Like I said, we're gonna open up the rest of these McDonald's pack in another video. Now that we know we have X and Y evolutions in these, I'm super excited. We have some Sword and Shield, some Darkness to Blaze. Stay tuned. We're gonna be getting some crazy good hits. Um, thank you guys for watching.